Thursday, May 18th, the 7 and 5 Hopkinton Hillers took on 11 and 6 Ashland, scoreless in the bottom of the third until Jake LeBlanc comes up with bases loaded and no outs. Left hand to pitch. Hit in the air over to left center, and that is going to get down for a base hit. All the way on the hill in left field, one run in, a second run right behind him. And McKenzie and Simos both score for the Hillers. It is a two RBI base hit for LeBlanc, who ends up at second base. Ashland scored a run in the top of the fourth. Hillers added on to the 2-1 lead in the bottom of the fifth. Two outs, two on, starting pitcher Brandon Kelly at the plate. They left hand the pitch. Got, got a, he gets a piece of this one over to center field, and that is gone. A three run homer by Brandon Kelly. And I could not think of a better way to help yourself than that. He absolutely crushed that ball. That one left me speechless, Larry Omar. Unbelievable. He jacked one off Jack. Kelly smacks a three-run homer, which scores Brian Gunn, Chris Burdick, and of course himself. He absolutely crushed the ball to make it 5-1 to one Hopkinton, heading into the sixth. Leg lift and the pitch. Hit in the air to center field. That is driven in, will drop down one in. And now a second run being waved around. The throw home is cut off by Reynolds, and it's a tie game, five to five. Dominic Cavanaugh scores, and Alex Holis. Ashland wasn't giving in, however. Ashland scores four runs, and the score is tied, five five. Heading in to the bottom of the sixth, but Steven Simos had something to say about that. Now he has a chance to get the W. As this is hit in the air, over to right field, towards the fence, and that one is going to clear the fence. That is a home run by Steven Simos. And you give up four runs last inning, but you come right back at it at the plate and knock one over the fence to retake the lead. Six to five, Hillers. 6-5 Hopkinton, top of the seventh. Ashland down to their final three outs. Shane Larry 0 for 2, did walk and score run in the sixth. And a swinging strike there, out number one. Leg lift and the pitch. Swinging strike, and he is going to run down the line, throw to first, not a problem, two away. Throwing from the stretch. Runner leading off of first. Yes, he won. There it is, strike three, and the Hopkinton Hillers get the victory. A six to five win for the Hillers. What a game between these two teams. Zach Sasitsky gave up a two out single in the inning, but recorded all three outs via the strikeout, and the Hillers take a wild game over Ashland, six to five. Despite solid work on the mound from starter Brendan Kelly, it was Zach Sosicki that ended up with the W. Kelly contributed big, however, with his three-run jack in the fifth, and Steven Simos ends up scoring the decisive run with his solo shot in the bottom of the sixth. The Hillers took two of their next three games, defeating Medway and Westwood. The Hillers baseball team stands at 10 and six on the season, and has clinched a trip to the playoffs.